In this video, we are going to see about RTD, its working principle, types and different measurement methods. What is RTD? Resistance temperature detectors are sensors used to measure temperature. Working principle Electrical conductors change resistance as they change temperature. This allows the temperature to be determined directly by measuring the resistance of the sensor. Measured resistance of the sensor is then compared with resistance value of the established curve. Different types of RTD sensor materials Platinum, Nickel, Copper, and Balco which is 70% Nickel plus 30% Iron. Temperature coefficient of resistance is denoted by Alpha. R0 is the resistance of the sensor at 0 degrees Celsius. R100 is the resistance of the sensor at 100 degrees Celsius. Construction of RTD RTD sensors generally contain a sensing element with extension leads attached that are placed into a protective sheath or housing. Types of RTD Based on construction, there are two types of RTD. They are Wire wound type and thin film type. Find highly purified platinum wire wound around a ceramic mandrel to produce the element. Thin film construction uses a precision laser to cut the sensor elements from a layer of platinum or nickel deposited over a stable ceramic base material. The sensor has very low mass and is therefore highly resistant to vibration and has a much faster speed of response than a wire wound sensor. Wire wound sensor is limited by the strain induced at the high temperature. Thin film type sensor is less stable than the others. Comparison of different sensing elements. There are three different measurement methods are available. Two wire RTD. 3-wire RTD 4-wire RTD Two wire RTD
the resistance of the sensor is measured and evaluated to determine the temperature of the sensor. The resistance of the lead wires is combined with the resistance of the sensing element. There is no way to correct the lead wire resistance. Total lead resistance will be A plus B this method is not recommended if accurate temperature measurement is desired and the length of the lead wires is more than a few inches. When the transmitter is mounted directly on the RTD, the lead wire length will be so small that the resulting error is not very significant. Three wire RTD. Total lead resistance will be B minus A. Three wire RTD minimize the effects of lead wire resistance as long as the outer legs are equal. However, it is not a complete solution because wire resistances are guaranteed only within a 10% tolerance. Therefore, if A and B are identical wires of identical lengths, their resistances can still differ within the 10% tolerance. Factors such as terminal corrosion and loose connections can still create significant differences between the lead resistances. Four wire RTD. Total lead resistance will be zero. Four wire RTD completely eliminates the lead wire effect. They are still limited by contact resistance. RTD tolerance class is given in below table. Typical RTD decode sheet is shown below. Thanks for watching this video, for more videos like this, subscribe to Simple Science.